Hello everybody and welcome to my channel. My name is Pineapple and today I am doing a starter apartment speed build. So if you're interested in this build, you can download it off of the gallery. My origin ID is PineappleYT. Um, this build is really exciting, at least for me I guess, um, because it is city living and base game only. Whenever a new expansion pack or game pack really not using the stuff packs but whenever a new like big thing comes out i try to make it so that i do a base game and that thing only um just because i realize that not everybody can um afford to have all of the packs um not everybody wants all of the packs and i'm sure it's very frustrating to download something and have half of the items missing or whatever i wouldn't know because i almost always get the stuff right off the bat so i don't know how frustrating that is but i can imagine it's pretty frustrating um so i definitely tried to um you know make this a really accessible build it is starter it was, it's a starter home so it's about like 20 thousand simoleons I think um, and it's base game and city living only so that's I think that's really great um, it was a little bit of a struggle but I did it like I think the hardest part for me was um, the fact that it's an apartment and so I had a little trouble at first the layout because the windows are like difficult these windows were difficult to work with I thought um, but I think I made it work out in the end it's um, a two bedroom one bathroom home so it's pretty teeny tiny I mean it was I think that was how it was to begin with um, but I definitely kind of switched around the layout and I wanted to make it a bit more open plan um, but yeah like this only took me about an hour to build and I had so much fun building it and I actually built it a little while ago but I just got so frustrated with um, the dynamics of uploading it to the gallery and whatnot. Like you have to delete one wall in every room so it's a whole room so you can upload it to the gallery. And then you have to make sure that Move Objects is on when you download it from the gallery. Um, otherwise it won't fit and it was just like... A nightmare and so I kind of just let it sit for a bit because I was just like mm -mm, it's not happening it's just not happening right now <laughs> uh, but yeah I ended up going with a sort of purple and navy sort of dark colors with dark wood um, and I really like how it turned out I think it looks more expensive than it is um, I didn't use super cheap furniture and I could kind of get away with that because it's such a small space and because it's an apartment I didn't have to really pay for quite as much stuff um but yeah so I did use some a little bit more expensive objects um but there isn't it's a little barren I don't know I really like it I think <laughs> of course I like it I built it um but I think I don't know what my favorite room is I I can't, it's one of the bedrooms, I think. It's either this one, I think it's this one. I think it's the master bedroom. Um, I mean, it's not really a master bedroom because I could not, for the life of me, figure out how to give it an ensuite. Um, so there's just one bathroom and it's just for everybody. Um, but right here is the kids' room and I sort of thought of going with the striped theme, but I think I would have had it to have the room be like one square smaller or one square bigger or wide um, for it to work uh, but I really liked how this turned out um, I ended up putting in a mural and I had one of my sims paint it um, and I uploaded it with a mural and it was like the perfect mural you'll see it you saw it at the beginning and you'll see at the end it just the color scheme it just fit the room perfectly that was the one I got my first try and I was so happy but yeah, here I'm building the world's most boring bathroom. <laughs> I like it was just like, eh, just just do it. Just just do the bathroom. It is it's a starter home. The bathroom doesn't have to be this like fanciest thing in the world. Um, but I did test everything and it all works. Um, and so that, well, I didn't test the craft the not the crafting table. This is a Minecraft what? Um, the little art um and crafts thing for the kids i think i'm about to put it in right now so i didn't test that but i think it would work and i think it'd be fine um but yeah i just it was a really this was a really fun apartment to build for me and it was just such a pity that how frustrating it was to like struggle with getting it available for you guys like i just feel like the sims team really just kind of 
threw some builders concerns out the window with this pack and so there's a lot of cool stuff but it is just so limited for people like me who like to build um but i will put my complainy pants well i guess i won't put them back on but i don't really want to say that i'm going to take off my pants because that's kind of weird but any let, let's just <laughs> let's just move on from that um it is i think it is after Thanksgiving in America when I'm going to post this. I am pre-recording this because I am going home um, to my parents' house and I don't have my desktop there, so I can't do like any Sims while I'm there. Um, but I had a fun Thanksgiving story I wanted to tell you guys. Um, so it's actually, <laughs> it's about my brother. So he was born a little bit after Thanksgiving and his due date was pretty much for Thanksgiving. And so... As some of you may or may not know, in thanks in uh, not in things. Oh my gosh, I can't talk. In Canada, Thanksgiving is in October, and so my parents were taking a trip in October while my mom was pregnant to Canada, and they were going to go get on this boat. And so the captain, you know, is talking with them, and he asks my mom, "Oh, when are you due?" And my mom is like, "Thanksgiving," and Thanksgiving for them was like two days away, and he was just like you're not coming on my boat. <laughs> and she was like, what? And he was just like, you're about to give birth. And she's like, no, Thanksgiving is in like a month. And he's like, you know, and then they did the whole like, oh, you know, ha ha ha. But like, <laughs> it's just, I love, I love things like that. Absolutely love it. Um, but yeah, I, like I said, I really like how this build ended up. I think my one complaint is that the entryway is a little depressing. <laughs> I think it's a little, it's a little depressing. Um, and the kitchen is a bit barren. I don't feel like I spent enough. Um, I didn't put as many, as much resources to it as it needed. Like these stools really help, but it's just like, it's, it's kind of sad. Um, but I hope that you guys enjoyed this build. If you did, feel free to give me a like, a comment, or subscribe, especially if you'd like to be notified as to when my next build is. Um, it's gonna be a really fun one, guys. Um, but yeah, um, oh god, what was I gonna say? Oh no. This ending has fallen apart, but, ah, oh god, I forgot it again. Screenshots are coming up soon. I hope you guys are all having a great day, and I will see you guys next time. Bye!